up y'all i'm about to start my hunting trip i'm not gonna be able to record me shooting the deer but i'm you know i'm just gonna vlog a little bit when i get the deer then i'm gonna show you guys what it looked like and everything you know i'm coming this left well about to leave academy had to grab a couple things because i was that i was short on but i wanted to show you guys that fishing is not all i do so i hope you guys stay tuned to that and enjoy it about to take off so i know you guys already seen my 243 you know fuel by hornady i'm shooting the precision hunters a 90 grain eldx and then this is the, my 3030 marlin with the gold trigger and i'm shooting um core lock i want to say 150 grain or 180 grain i'm not sure but i will show you guys that once we get to camp listen i kid you not we got like within an hour of Georgia state line. Like it was so like hot. Then like it was like a temperature switch like that. Oh my gosh, it's freezing right now. Man, but we got maybe an hour away to go and we'll be there. So I hope you guys stay tuned for this. This is probably like, I, th I think this, yeah, this is my first vlog or whatever you want to call it. I wish I could record the hunt for you guys, but if I get a deer, I will still show you all that. So stay tuned and subscribe. Cold as heck right now. But I'm gonna get back to y'all because you know I gotta get some sleep. Get ready for this hunt in the morning. And hopefully I'll be back tomorrow, but I'll be back as soon as I get one. Stay blessed. I'm out. Oh, we got us a pig. <laughs> She like it. Nope. She want to come to Georgia and hunt with me so bad. What's up y'all so leaving my stand i see my deer so i'm coming back to get my granddad i didn't go walk up to my deer but walking the trails i see my deer laying down i haven't seen him up close but man i'm just so thankful for everything that my granddad and my uncle has taught me throughout these years and me growing up learning about wildlife granddad teaching me how to fish and you know my uncle He's like an expert at hunting. My granddad is too. And you know, anything I ever wanted to know, my uncle told me, or my granddad told me, the things that they knew. And I got my deer. And my granddad, man, I remember him taking me to the stand when I was at his kneecap. And now my granddad can't really hunt anymore. And I think this is like the best experience in my whole life to be able to bring my granddad to see my deer while he can't do it anymore. To show him that what he built, which is me, got us dinner on the table. So stay blessed and have a wonderful day. There you go. Whew. Yep. Got a... Got a nice deer. A very, if you guys are new to hunting, this is a very, very good shot placement right there. But yeah, you see the antlers. It's a real good meat deer. But that's meat. Showing sure up some meat. All right, Granaddy. Right there. A young deer for meat is, is better than a big one.
That's a 308 right there. That's 243. See the difference? Oh my gosh. But yep. Yep, like I was saying, going to the grocery store. Nice body. Just not a big rack. I couldn't see where I hit this deer. Because I shot him. It was so thick when I shot him. Get it. But look right behind the shoulder. Literally. Right behind the shoulder. Then the exit wound on the other side. Woo! Those Hornady Precision Hunters don't play. But yep, that's a legal deer. Big body. Very thankful. This is the same road. Look at that. That's beautiful. But yes, this is the same road back that way where I got my deer. But on the side of the road, picking up pecans. My girl says she never had any and she don't know what she's missing out on. But I'm gonna try to get enough. Hopefully my uncle can get some and yeah, this is this is nice. This is the part of me that you guys didn't know about. And I know you guys didn't get to see me kill the deer. But just giving you a little insider of me. But next season, my girl will be in the woods. And we're going to get that kill on video. Because my uncle said, he let me get meat this season. And next, next season... It's trophy hunting, so stay tuned. And I get back with you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow is the day we depart. Two coolers full of meat. Bless you. All right, you guys, I'm back. Back home. You know, I gotta get back to buy my girl Chick Fil A. You know, that's rules and to being in relationships. But anyways, you know, I told you guys what I was shooting: the Hornady 90 grain. Precision Hunters, ELDX. I'm shooting a 243 and they do really good. So don't let anyone tell you that a 243 is too small. Listen, if that's what you're comfortable shooting, go ahead. But anyways, that's all I got for you guys. I hope you enjoy that. Enjoy a side of me that you guys didn't already see. But next season, my girl will be in the stand with me recording the, the whole hunt. 